Hey, I'm Tatiana with 10 Minute Tasks. In today's video, I will be mounting this clear acrylic calendar. This is a product review. I had a little issue with the screws here. They weren't fitting through the holes on the calendar, so I had to drill them to make them larger. The customer service of this product got back to me right away. They're sending me a new calendar and the screws along with a new pen because I mentioned to them that the pen on this calendar was too light and they're going to send me a chalk pen which they say is much more legible, just a little harder to erase. They've sent multiple markers. This also comes with the product. It's like a little eraser and then it comes with this cloth right here. And then I've mounted this with the gold and these actually come in the matte black, gold, and silver. So if you have a different color preference, so great customer service. I do recommend it because it's a beautiful calendar. I have this in my home gym to keep me organized with my workouts. These shelves I already had before, I'm kind of like repurposing them. And I think they look nice up here on the wall, keeps it organized. Putting this together, measure your wall. Use screw gun and drill the holes. A lot of the anchors that I'll use the hammer on will bend in half and it's so annoying. So I always get these. So I'm gonna put one of these on each side of the board. So I need to get a drill bit on my drill. I use the Ryobi cordless and I'm gonna go and find the right drill bit for it. Okay, I'm going to use the DeWalt 532 drill bit. I'm gonna put it nice and tight on there. Now I'm switching to this drill bit. Then I'm going to take the screw and put it through this. So I'm pretty sure I hit a stud which means there's just wood right behind this wall. There, that's nice and sturdy. I don't wanna put it any more than that because I don't want the screw to strip the inside of that wood. So I just got it just tight enough. <laughs> okay, now here's the hole. I'm supposed to put this into the hole but it's not, it doesn't really fit. So I don't know how to get it to the other side. I'm trying to screw it, but I can't. So I think what I'm gonna do is use the drill bit and make it a little bit wider. <sighs> I finally did it. I put it on number two and then I'm using this drill bit and I finally did it and now it, the hole is big enough so that there's a little bit left here so I can screw it onto the wall. Oops. Oh no! that they gave me. July, so it's J. 
July. And you do get a cloth like this and you get all of these markers. So you have lots of different colors. So this needs to go somewhere. So I need to make like a shelf or something. Looks like the first is on a Saturday. July and the first is on a Saturday. So one, two, three. Twenty-nine days. There are thirty and thirty-one, so it's kind of missing that row. There's not enough. So I circled July, starting with Saturday was the first, and I made all the days of the month. However, there is a row missing because there should be six rows, and there is only five. So the thirtieth and the thirty-first are missing. That's okay, we're gonna start checking off the days that I did my workout. So I started on July 3rd. I'm gonna put a T on it for Tati. T, T. And if anybody else comes over, they can use a different color and put their initials. The days of the week, I can put different workouts. And then here are the notes I can make. And then this is my to-do list. This can be the workout or any kind of projects I want to get done, and then some reminders maybe. Go ahead and check out the description box. I'll leave a link there for you. And if you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. You can also subscribe to my channel and tap the notification bell too to be notified of the very next video. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Peace.